All right, so perhaps I should go into stream readers. I don't know. Okay, so we're back. I actually shut myself down. Excuse me. I'm going to put some music on. Hello, hello, how are you, Darth? Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Is there anything we can do to help? Hello, Phoebe. How are you? This is a channel full of who or community full of people who have experienced that. You're in good company, but I get the feeling. Finishing writing before bed sounds like a brilliant plan. I am currently. Um, thank you for giving her a shout out, giving Phoebe a shout out. I am currently going to write one chapter and then I'm probably jumping right back off. Um, and if we have over, if we have like 10 people by the time I jump off, we will raid. If I do, if we do not, I will probably do the strange thing and just get off, which is so weird for me. But I'm starting so late. I'm so wiped out. After I got home from work yesterday, I just did not have the energy or the, the ability to go right to sleep. I was still wired. Sweet. 
it's over. We have one. We now pick a boon. That's an all ranged units thing, not a, not just an archer's thing. So I'm totally gonna use that. That may not that might seem silly, but there's a reason for spreading them like that. Specifically, that particular archer is going to have a shield around it. I meant to switch that up, but it only be good for like one or two seconds. Oh. Oh, two minutes. I got a whole new th another two minutes. I should really go do coffee.
All right, so we'll do this again. Put this here. And start battle. I didn't realize when I first put the soul on there that it was just going to freeze the characters. So when I get out of dungeons, I'm probably take that soul off. Um, healers have 59% more healing. Warriors are getting regeneration for health for every four seconds when they're not in combat assassins attack and post 100 percent damage vulnerability against non-assassins Whenever a cursed unit dies, it spawns a mad ghost minion that attacks enemies and allies alike. No, no, we don't want that. Let's go with this. And I will throw out an assassin unit. Hi, Nova. It is always a pleasure to see you, my friend. How are you? I'm just doing dentons for probably... Mm -hmm. 
Oh, why, thank you. <laughs> I'm good. I'm working on stories and fire updates. Oh, we've got two anthologies coming together. I have a new cover to design, but I probably won't get to the covers over the weekend, which is just fine. Stories on fire, short story a day, writing. Same thing as 31 days, but we're doing it in January and September instead of January and August, so it became stories on fire. I think so. I just got out a post, sent, put it out in pub, out to the to the world um, about the launch stream, which will be. I'm gonna do something I have never ever done before. Um. Hawk Rocket. Hey, how are you? It has been for ages. And that is about that. Let's see what our next ones are. So what are you up to? All right, this is a defensive position, so having everybody under the bubble is actually going to be good.
self care, hey, you gotta do what's necessary to keep you going. Oh, I'm so sorry. But when you're a caretaker, that's gonna be a thing. A major thing. And you do have to take care of you in the mix. I'm glad you're making sure you're able to, to do that. That didn't work. I don't know what lugs are. Oh no, they're parts of cars. That's not what I meant. I'm going to all who need them. Thank you. Mm. Yeah, that's got to be hard to come to. Hello, sweetie. Very cool. When you're going through stuff and it feels like you're losing con losing control of yourself, it's easy to misconstrue attempts to help as exactly that kind of thing. Is there any kind of like a a, an agreement you guys can come to perhaps something you guys can outline in writing so you both remember what would be intended when some things are said
All right, let's see what we got. We're going to curse these guys because cursing is good. Understood. They're just going to walk up and blow up. Oh, they're avoiding him. Well, that's annoying. But we won. I am building up all the archers because I am hoping for a specific uh It is rare for a balloon buster to survive a battle. You can throw an assassin at it. Literally running the book at it. So Nova, you like my skins? I don't know if I showed them off last time you made it. To the sh so you were able to make it in. Oh, uh, it's probably the same ones. It's just my penguin heads and my book. So far. You like it? Like the skin? So I thank you. We have to get to 100 skin points, which is like, um, I think, 10 more of the books or uh, 20 more, not quite 20 more of the, the head skins. Thank you. Then we can get another full skin. And I have ideas. Hey, Caps. How are you? Trying to find a tool I had. It's just a temporary thing. I just wanted to okay, this one I am not using it very often. I say it's a good reason to take a day off. And I'm glad you're doing that. Ginger, cinnamon, apple, and you say hello. <laughs> How did the the granola stuff come out? The Kitty Apples 500 is being aptly run by all the babies. Okay, not all six of them, but the tiny littlest ones. I can understand where that would that would slow things down for a bit clockwork up. So all of those who would like to assist me in my lack of sanity, 
September 1st, I will be live. I will have a special guest, but I will be live at midnight. Very cool. Very, very cool. I'm glad to hear that. Mine. My midnight, which is central time, which means I'm really going to be dead. Stories on Fire is a short story a day challenge where you literally commit to writing a short story every single day between 1,000 and 15,000 words. Really, it could be, it should probably be 1,000, 10,000 words. Um, but yeah, the, a complete short story start to finish every single day. I do need to update links, but it is on the Writing Network website where you can sign up and get started. Uh, you'll get, I'm working on setting up the newsletter probably tomorrow or might end up being Monday, but it'll be a newsletter where I'm sending out the prompts so that anybody who is signed up will get a news, will get prompts delivered to their mailbox. However, You'll find more prompts on, on the writing network and you'll find prompts on the prompts from the writing network go into discord. The stories on fire links. If you'd like, yes, absolutely. And all you would need is the writing network. The main blog put main timeline shows up on the blog. So you just need the writing network. And the sign up form is right there in where you start to where it starts discussing st stories on fire darth i don't know if you're up with for it but could you give caps a shout out for me please i do feature streamers who are streaming stories on fire on the website too so if you're okay with that, I will send you, I will uh, private message you a link uh, so we can get you featured. Thank you, Darth. That was pretty quick. No, you don't have to be a streamer at all to participate. I just want, I feature the streamers and their locations online so that as they are celebrating, everybody can celebrate, and that as uh, um, that people can find places to celebrate their their successes and their victories and things they're excited about and things they're looking forward to. So you guys know where to find each other, basically. Well, it was my favorite um, penguin skin. I would like my penguin skin. Why is it not giving me my skin? It could put out pretty and purple, but that's not a good goal. I'll just do this again. You know, that's exactly what I was hoping Stories on Fire would be for some people is a way to build and rebuild a writing habit. So that would be awesome. And I hope it works. I know it's a lot of fun because you get to challenge yourself and you get all sorts of different ways to do so. But yeah, you know, you don't have to be a streamer. 
And for those who are streamers, typically, uh, there will be a post at some point saying, you know, uh, in the Discord where I will be looking for anybody who has not, uh, not been featured that will be streaming. <clears throat> To fill out a form so we can get that up and scheduled. Exactly. Whether they're full and complete stories. The goal is to have five stories. The goal is to always, or, or to have stories. You're always going to end up with more than you started the month with. And in many cases, when you've been doing this for long enough, those stories are all things that you know you can go back to and f and polish. And when you're just getting started, it's good for just getting in the habit of, of creating every day, of writing every day. It becomes a boon and a boost to backlists and future production alike. It gives you opportunities to challenge your mind and form new creative ventures and challenge where you've been with your creativity and where you want to go with it it's a beautiful beautiful challenge and the flexibility of it literally having uh having it the way it is is that it allows us to really try different things like this year we're starting with themes so if we start with a theme, the first theme for the first week is animal antics. So all of the prompts are going to tie into animal antics. So it might be um, watching a squirrel on the road causes what to happen. Or finding a cat asleep on your front seat when your car is closed and locked creates what uh we had one prompt at one point where it was finding paw prints on the walls and ceiling where did they come from where Jordan, if you want that we will do that Seriously, if you would like that, I will make sure that happens next year. We will put that into. I think we're actually going to be pretty good. I'm still going to curse them. 
I think we might be pretty good. All right, well then, see, April is camp, right? Would March... Would March be a good month to do that? Because I know I'm going to want February off, so to speak. So we'll get through January. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. The only difference is that if things go smoothly and I decide we're going to do a Stories on Fire anthology, I'm going to be picking based on the themes. Which is where the themes are coming from. And I'm saying if because the truth is... I'm truly not positive that we're going to do that. I've had some interest, but I haven't had a ton of interest. And I've tried very early on in the challenge to to do it like a magazine format because you could be a little bit more flexible as to the variety of things. Yeah, I have. I find myself using the stories to fit or using the prompts to fit the stories I already want. So it's like, I know I want to write a story about this character and that character kind of a thing. And then, um, you know, how does this prompt help me develop a story for that? That's been the way I've been doing it. And sometimes I, I, there's usually two prompts every day to pick from. The one is like, use this sentence in your story type of a prompt. And the other one is a prompt for... Um, you know, setting, setting and, and, and inspiration. What I find myself doing is both. Like I might start the story with the, the given sentence and it follows through on the other prompt. However, you don't have to use any of them if you don't want to. There is a guidebook that the streamers will be able to give away. There is a streamer kit. I've got to update it for 2020 three still I really should do it for January is have it prep for January too um yeah yeah Darth was using story cubes so you can use whatever prompts come to mind as long as you are coming in you're you're writing a full short story within 24 hours based on the time you start and you are completing it in that time frame or for me, I tend to do it in my waking hours because once I'm I'm down for the day, I'm down for the day. So I try to write it in the morning. What you will find is that when I get on my regular stream, I will try to complete a full story on stream. Most days I'll get pretty close. This might be a good opportunity, Phoebe. You know, clock walking, no point in rushing it. And the great news is, like you said, this would be a good way to get uh, to get started, you know, just in, in getting creative again. And maybe by the end of September, as you're getting your confidence back and your creativity back, maybe that'll get you in a better place to start streaming. Maybe. I mean, there's only one way to find out for sure. But if you go to the writing network, that's where the thing, where it will be hosted. That's where you will find the sign up form. It's on Stories on Fire um, update or something like that. And it's just kind of a pitch for Stories on Fire, essentially. I should pin that one to the top, come to think of it. I should go to that right now while I'm thinking about it, actually. Save this draft. I was working on the night before Stories on Fire post. So let me go back over here. This one. Click edit. Where's my pin? I guess not a quick edit. Don't make it that easy. I mean, it shouldn't be necessarily since I already published. There it is. Stick to top of blog. There it is. Okay. So now that should be the stories on fire launch.
Um, thank you. I also, I appreciate you putting it here in the chat too. I also just pinned it on the blog so that it'll be at the very top where you can find the sign up sheet and everything on the very first post that you come across. Um, Caps, what time, uh, what rough time frame will you be streaming? Because I am thinking early, I'm in central time. I typically stream about five, this could be fun, about 5 a.m. My time in central time. Oh yeah, you were going to get the Star Wars story cubes, right, Darth? You know, you can write fan fiction. This doesn't have to be anything you're ever going to publish. If that's what's going to get your creative juices going, go for it. it. Sweet. I'm glad you did. Because I know, I remember you being kind of excited about that. Or more than kind of. Um, I'm only asking caps because I'm writing a list right now of streamers for people to watch for in the launch post. This will go out on the 31st of the and I would like to include you in it so people are looking for you if they're looking for the, the event. And I will be copying this to, to the newsletter for those who are getting it delivered to them as well. I think we could still win this. I'm not... Oh yeah, they have a greater range, so they don't need as much. I just hope they're going to be good ranged backups. You know, Weirdron, you don't have to... One to four... Uh, you're getting ready... You're going to update your stream schedule for September. Okay. I will put you on the next... on on. The early, the, the early American schedule, or later American schedule, later American schedule as of right now. But if you need me to update it before the post goes live, let me know. And where Dren, you could also commit to doing, you know, 15 this month instead of 30. I know you can do 30. But it, it's not a bad thing to kind of still have something in the back of your mind. I know when I'm not Feeling great. Being creative isn't always the greatest thing. Easiest thing, though, so. Sometimes it helps. Sometimes it's distracting from the thing, but whatever the thing might be. Excuse me. All right. So. That was fun. 88 stories between now and September 1st. Are these, if these are all short stories, you could do them during Stories on Fire or shorter stories. And that would help you get out 30 of them. Fan fiction is entirely possible with this event or yeah, we, while many of us who are involved in it are also publishing and publishers, and this becomes a backlist boost for us, 
It is not a necessity at all. You do not have to do this. Exactly. Yeah, Weird Drone's got it. it. It's about the writing, not the content. You can do fan fictions all day long as long as you're doing a short story. Oh, how awesome. Well, then you're already participating is what you're telling me. <laughs> Right, exactly. 30 stories should be pretty easy. Because, I mean, you got to remember the 30 stories are... Ah, welcome, Nathalia. How are you, my friend? The 30 stories are just a thousand... Can, can just be a thousand words. As long as it's a full story. Get to, from point A to point B and whatever you want in between. Thank you so much, Dar love that you do that now that you're putting in all those short shout outs for me i'm really grateful um and yeah please whatever shout out darth puts in please go feel free to follow and be excited these are wonderful streamers and fabulous people let's see Mm -mm. Hmm. Do you have a number in your name? Let me make sure I get that right. Caps. Are you going to do a little bit of writing on your stream too, Weirdrin, for September if you decide to join us? Licorice, licorice recoil. What's it about? Uh, I hope you do feel better soon, Nathalia. I'm so sorry, hon. Um. Uh, I might have a browser-based program you could try that might make some of that easier if you're up for it. I don't know if you would be or not. I know I'm going to be trying a new program, which I will be introducing on stream later this month. If it works out, I may turn my my stories directly into a book. I might pull them out into different books. I, I'm kind of excited to try this new program. Uh, only short of breath. I'm glad you're feeling better already. That's that's quick recovery then, and I hope it gets faster for you, hun. True, my sinuses are full, so it looks funny, and it's it's crazy because they're not trying to empty normally. So I'm just trying to push them from there so they're not swelling my face.
Oh, that sounds like fun. Okay, so it's been a full week at this. I hope it goes fully away quickly. Like, today would be great that this is the last day you're battling any symptoms. I am sure I'm missing people, but we will go from here. I don't know why I'm putting everybody else on there with their their streaming names since that's the way people are going to find them. But I'm not putting this one on there. What a dork. All right, let's get over to the battle. Oh, how awesome. There is a program that I'm going to be introducing. I try to do this before every story is on fire. I try to introduce something new. And something I don't see active in our community. I did Novel AI one time, and I really do love that. Uh, I was considering Pseudo-Write, but... I can't really find it to wrangle it exactly the way I want without using um, more unnecessary stress. I'm a pantser, so too much planning is going to take too much, too much. But I found a program that kind of integrates the, the best parts of a lot of different stuff in one spot. Ooh, Darth took all the top on that one. Way to go. All right. Tanks with the last left. Undying scrum, conscript, flag bearers. Let's read this. Flag bearers, centurions, and musketeers grant 50% damage attack, speed, and resistance to nearby undead, and gain control of that near, of nearby mag ghosts of equal or lower to, tier. Yeah, let's do that thing. And then I'm going to throw another musketeer in there. Life is good. Uh, this is where dungeon starts to get serious, guys, at nine. So really try to, let's try to watch the markers where we can, because I will put them down based on how they will be boosted by the boons, basically. Go away. I'm helping you. That should help better. These guys over here are our allies. They could die very easily, but they are our allies. Okay. Where John, I'm gonna put you into the streamers list if that's okay with you, and then we'll see how it goes. And what time are you going to be are when you stream Darth? Do you know if you'll be streaming? You usually stream in the evenings, right? Well, evening's my time, so your Pacific time. I'm just making a list. I'll put links on the website to everybody's streams. This is just so that if somebody surfs in and wants to know where to get started, they know 
who to look for that under that knows what's going on with stories on fire, that kind of thing. I was excited one year we had a Russian streamer who was doing stories on fires with a for, fire with us in Russian. Unfortunately, I didn't catch their streams because they're in a completely different time zone. But we've got a much bigger team now. So if we do get an international person that isn't doesn't have uh, our huge following, I'm going to share them in a way that I will hopefully... Okay, and your Eastern, Weirdren? Okay. You're thinking more. Okay. I, I Then I've got you in the right category. You're thinking more in the mornings when you're more awake now. Okay. But are you thinking like your 3 a.m. like when I'm getting up and streaming kind of morning? Or are you thinking after or in the same time frame I'm, I'm on? Like, roughly, so that I can put you into the right category, Darth. Thank you for that epic, Caps. Much appreciated. And obviously, um, this isn't going to be a set in stone kind of list. Understood. I'm going to put you in our later list with, with Safa and Serper Kings. The earliest people playing stories on or doing stories on fire or stories on fire support that I can think of right now. Coffee Quills, Amanda Panda Sensei, and Element Eds. And then it'll be me. Then on the list is me, Kindar, Caps, Maya, Weirdrin, Safa, depending on when Safa, what day of the week Safa starts. Our late nighters right now or late night for me. Safa, Darth, and then. We have weekend. You signed up, Phoebe. Are you going to stream it or are you going to, so I can add you to this list? This list isn't set in stone. It's just an idea. So it's not a necessity. I just happen to be working on it right now. You are awesome. What, what group should I put you in? Are you closer to, say, Japan time or are you closer to Pacific time? Somewhere probably possibly in between. I know we've had people participating from Malaysia before. I don't know where everybody's at. <laughs> the one thing I will ask is that all of our you're closer to Japan time, so I will add you to that first part of the list. Hmm. If I wasn't just working on it, I would have harassed you in private about all this. But hey, this gives us a chance, all of us a chance to chit chat and get it straight. And it guarantees I have a better chance of getting the list of people to watch for a lot more concise. Or accurate would be more correct, would be correct. All right, we're going to curse them and hopefully they will be dying quickly. nice okay i've got a short list of weekend warriors right now i've got two people that i can think of that i know will be um oh yeah i love those i am going to throw out a Flag bearer guys, feel free to throw out whatever is going to work for you. Oh, planets. Yeah, we definitely need the, need the, the units to build. Again, we're going to try to do this watching the 
the layouts, please. Our range units are actually the most boosted right now. But we want, if we're going to do this, we want at least a flag bearer in here. And hopefully a healer. I don't want to. Hopefully we get enough. I think we could. That is Creative Church Central, Weirdrin. There we go. Are you going to be doing stories on fire with us, Nathalia, this month? Next month? Sorry. September? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for giving him a shout out. We love that tiger guy here. That tiger guy, the tiger rights, is a supporting stream. That's all good. I gotta take care of you. And I know you got a lot of projects going on. It was just a thought. I, I figured I'd ask while you're here. And while I'm working on this, it's, a, it's basically a reference list of streamers that will be doing stories on fire. This will, I will literally be copying and pasting this and every all of the, these earlier posts for stories on fire into those who are getting the newsletter. That will probably go out uh, every couple of days, the last week of the month. So if you've signed up, you'll get the newsletter, the daily newsletter, or it, well, it'll be daily during September because it's going to deliver the prompts. And with the prompts, I, if you guys want, and you guys can tell me now for those who are here, I can include any tips or ideas or tools or suggestions that I know help me with my writing to do better faster um it would i don't want to do a whole lot in the prompts because i don't want to take away from the challenge but if i'm already going to be pre-scheduling the newsletter like i'm doing the blog posts i can throw a tip or two in there ahead of time so definitely let me know and for those who have been doing this let me know if you have tips that you think i should include in the newsletter i can do that or in the on the website Yes, I came on here to write a chapter, and what I'm actually accomplishing is Stories on Fire, which is fine. It's still important stuff. Our Weekenders are definitely... Author Brian Liu. Telling Artho. Telen will definitely be doing Stories on Fires with us. Story on Fires with us, but... Yeah, and if you missed a day, yeah, there's no, this is a stress-free challenge. I'm just throwing that out there. This is a stress-free challenge. There will be perks. There will be things. Um... Oh, yay. And what would you name your writing style, weird? Hmm. Or what did you name your writing style? 
with stories on fire, this is supposed to be fun. What is the, the thing you're trying to accomplish? Why do you want to do this? Yes. That's exactly... That's That was exactly my thought. Yeah. Oh, yeah. If you are streaming stories on fire, the, the emote that Darth has, you'll have access to it. You can add it to your emote cycle. I'm going to see if I can do a better version of it for everybody. Assuming I have the time, but if not, that particular one will be there. Inlining. Fill me in on what's inlining. Okay. I don't think we're going to get this one, guys. Even with the lich spawning. We just don't have enough. <laughs> so so I should blame all of you no, I'm just kidding <laughs> oh maybe the witch will get us enough maybe oh the spiders are going to be a problem Huh. Looks like the lich maybe just getting the one on there. Welcome back, Nathalia, my friend. Oh! I like that description. I've, I'm familiar with that description. It's actually how I make my story Bibles. We won, guys. Yeah. I like that. All units. Yes, we want all units. All right, I'm putting out another uh, flag bearer. You guys don't have to, but. Yeah, you can absolutely use short stories. And then those short stories that you're using for world building become tools for later things if you're publishing even if you're putting them on wattpad or you're not putting them out in public or you're putting them anyplace else they become tools for you to use uh, in other ways if you're going to put them out to, to readers and they become good reference points when you're trying to sort the things can't complain when that happens either I would like if we could get one more flag bear in this mix, guys. Which we're just gonna. One of the short stories you did in the past for NaNoWriMo, you're considering putting it into an anthology with local writing group. If you do a second one, that was awesome. The interest in a Stories on Fire anthology is the reason why we've, we're building out, out uh, themes so that we can kind of develop a theme. I'm going to put caps in this one too.
Caps, you said you're part of um the TikTok book community. Or am I remembering that wrong? Do you mind if I uh, send you a Discord message? I've got bunches of questions because I've not been able to develop on, on TikTok. i got a friend who's helping me work on Instagram and I would... Uh, of course, Instagram was kind enough to, to decide to suspend me. I posted my own video, took down my own video because I had the timing wrong. And then they just suspended me. It was so wonderful. Thank you, Caps. I would appreciate it. Um, I, I will probably do that when I get off stream and just send you a wall of text that you can parse however you choose. <laughs> All right. So our weekenders, assuming nothing else changes, author Brian Liu, Talon Artho, and Caps Girl. And I'm going to tentatively add Kitten Sapphire, but she has she doesn't know that she's going to be able to do this with us or not this year or this round. Okay, did they ever give you a reason why you were insta banned? Because the nearest reason I can come up with is that the video I uploaded and then changed my mind on was was on Facebook first. But that's all I can come up with. They never told me. Oh, yeah, this is. See, that's, that's, the, that's the kind of stuff that drives me nuts. And I realize that they have to automate a lot of things. But having no no clue what's up. If you would like caps in the Discord, there is a bunch of fun trailers. Um, including one Darth made that you would be able to reuse if you want to use it as part of your video. Let me tag you where that's at. It's writing team. Welcome, Lobby Trumps. There's more stuff. Um, ah, but it ended up going. Where did it go? It's not. I need to merge stuff is what I need to do. Okay. Um, okay, I just tagged you. You need the easy to read? Yeah. I tagged you in the stuff where the stuff is best located. I would like to curse them, but I'm not thinking that's going to happen. We have a lot of liches, so let's go ahead and haste what we do have and let's go for it. 
55 and 66 enemies. Wow, my eyesight is tiring still. Tired still. Nice. We might actually, I think we're going to get this. Yeah, I did that. I actually overslept. That's why my stream started so late. I got up, fed cats, went back to bed, and that was that. But, turned out I got, I was able to make sure I got a good list of people. Also, if you want to drop your link to TikTok in here, uh, caps. Feel free. We'll do that. Feel free to drop your TikTok link or any other socials you want, you've got into the chat. Okay, this is just a draft. It's still going to be updatable. Stories on Fire launch day, midnight UTC launch stories on fire event. Um, some might encounter stories on fire streamers before others as it's a rolling event by time zones. Here's our list of streamers. This is going to be disappointing.
Okay, so Dungeons has been really good for productivity this morning. I will say that. All right, so uh, Midnight UTC launches stories on fire events. Some might encounter stories on fire before others, as it is a rolling event by time zone. Here's a short list of streamers in the event. Watch for stories on fire tag on Twitch, YouTube, and now TikTok for a complete list. Coffee Quills, Amanda Panda Sensei, Elemented in the Backlog Phoebe Quest. Phoebe will be streaming, be our earliest streamers. The next wave you might encounter are the Lady Rights, the Tiger Rights, Cavs Girl, Maya Rights, Weirdrin, and Usurper Kings. Our late night, later night, our later friends, not later late night, sorry. Our later friends are Usurper Kings, Darth Torlin, and our weekenders, uh, author Brian Liu, Telen Artho, Caps Girl, and possibly Kitten Sapphire. We will see a Kitten Sapphire. I, I'm not releasing this yet. The list is not complete, so... Let me see if I can find that um, that after we start the event, I'm gonna see if I can find the form for streamer questions. I forgot to mark oh, somebody did remember a flag bearer, okay. Yeah, if we get to the end of one of these dungeon battles on this particular run and don't have a flag bearer, somebody please throw one in. Worst case scenario, they'll die and give us more skeletons to fight with. Best case scenario, they'll be the boost we need. Sweet. And we continue on. We'll probably continue this stream at this rate until we die in dungeons. Until we lose all of our boons. So pretty much however this goes will determine how long I stream. That's going to kind of make it funny. Let's do that. Because that's a ranged unit total thing. That should be a good run, I think. There are a lot of enemies. All right, let me find my streamer questionnaire. Some stuff to fix in the work one thing. This will run back to my drive.
That's the form to pull out for streamer feature. Oh, Darth. If you're going to be streaming and you choose to, I will happily, you'll be sprinkled into the website for features. It's not the fanciest thing, but it's an opportunity to, to just get some more links and some more eyeballs from the event to your to your stream. And hopefully it will, it will help last beyond the stream. That is just fine. I just wanted to make sure you had it. And if you need to ask me for it again, that's fine too. If you really, really, really don't want to do it, that's just fine. You don't have to. I might, but I might not be the person posting it on the website. All right. Distracted with Lego is going to happen. Let's see how this goes. Ooh, somebody got bold and threw out a necromancer. That will be helpful. Do we also have a flag bearer on that field? Uh oh, that might be it. Well, we'll see. Good morning, sir. Huh? Thank you. Very, very nice. We're just trucking right along with these winds. This is an all units thing, so we are choosing an all units thing over all the rest because it's always better. In my humble opinion, anyway. All right, I know my musketeer is going to boost everybody, so I'm going to throw the musketeer out. We know we need ranged units, and they should be near the musketeer because that's where the boosts are going to come from. We know we need assassin units, for sure. Hey, Mal, how are you? We know we need a flag bearer, at least one. I 
after that it's fair game. And then just for the sake of cutting things out. How goes the creative moves in all the things? What kind of collab store are you wanting to do with? Or now? What are you hoping to do? Rest well, Phoebe. Good night, my friend. Yeah, what ideas do you want to focus on? What are you hoping to get that hoping to do with it? Could definitely be an interesting collaboration. Are you thinking a singular story? Are you thinking uh, multiple? You good? A single story. Hmm. <laughs> that was a good question. 
Natalia, or Nathalia. Wow. Braining. Nobody said I need to do that, right? That's overrated. All right, I fixed the one of the timers. So I got to fix the command now. Okay, I am cursing them again and hoping that does us some good. There you go. We lost that one. I was afraid that was going to happen. All right. So we are going to go here. Sorry about the noise in the background. Yeah, Faye could be a lot of fun to play with. Although I haven't published anything with Faye in them myself. But they're absolutely are a lot of fun to play with. I wasn't even paying attention to this. All right, so we did a good, good dungeons run, guys. Where are we on here? Let's do one regular chat, regular challenge, then we'll find somebody to raid. Honestly, I'm going to be looking for somebody to, to collaborate on a project with me in October. But we're it's going to be kind of a different sort of project. But I don't think it's going to be quite what you're looking for. Part of it is uh, testing a new program with me. That one needs to get shut off. Well, enjoy your sleep. It's a writing program. It'll help you to do all the things. Rest well, Darth. Um, let's make sure that's right. Yep, that's that's it. I don't know if it'll go to stories. Uh, link. That's exactly who I will probably raid. I don't think I've raided. I don't know. Did I raid him this week? But yeah, that's that's probably who will we we will be raiding.
I don't think I've rated him this week. So yeah, we will definitely be rating Kendar. No, I did yesterday because it was a rate and go. But it'll probably be Kendar. I had to I had to run out the door at the same time. I had something come up. I was expecting to be able to come back on stream yesterday. It didn't work out that way. Are you already looking in his stream now? Okay. Para qué? And I know I'm stupid. No, you're not. Okay, I was just curious, but yeah, we'll probably right into him. All right, I got a lot of things fixed. Yeah, stuff are set up. We got the first set of streamer stuff coming in, so we can get those scheduled.
just have Just the one I need. No. Mm hmm Hello, Jax. I apologize for missing the missing the greeting. Okay. Yes, I do. Tear, we need to talk. Before I forget, because the wind will blow when I forget. Um... We're probably going to put a hold on a lot of things until the end of September. But I'll explain everything when I when we talk. Probably I'll be getting off stream here as soon as this battle is over. Oh, that'll work out too. Perfect. But um, if you're up for it, we'll do. We're gonna raid Kendar the Tiger rights here in. Oh, we're gonna go feed the dragon. Uh, first. That's a major, that's a wonderful accomplishment and one that's greatly appreciated, my friend. <laughs> it's all good. Saiza was hiding on a different page. What if I had gotten into the story I was writing? Then Saiza would have been on screen. So there's that.
Any objection if we raid the if we start early? So I give it five more minutes and then we'll start the battle. All right, one or two more units probably, and we'll get started. It's like three minutes. All right, let's see how this goes. We're a little early, but I still think we got them. We already outnumber them, so. Hydration. Thank you, Widrin. Goodies have been passed out, and we are raiding Kindar, the Tiger Raids. And let's see if I can do this without a raid and run this time. Thank you guys for hanging out with me, though I got here late. Thank you for all of your help through the stories and fire stuff, and I hope that your day is as blessed and wonderful as you've made mine. I love you guys.
My pleasure.